in my last video, I was doing the bounce drum kit and the bounce uh, bounce coming up contest. And I was trying to get their new plugin to work, but for some reason I didn't have access to it. But I do now, and so I'm making this video because I'm trying to do first reaction, see what this thing is all about, see if it's cool. Uh, once again, I just as just full transparency, as soon as I downloaded this thing, my email got another one of those risks and liabilities and just a contract. So if you're gonna use this thing, I don't know how they're going to prove it, but they will probably come after you if you make a multi-platinum record with using this plugin. So, use it as your own risk. That's my warning to you. They are coming in hot with their legal agreements for their products. With that being said, um, so I got this MIDI loaded up. Um, I'm using the Expand 2 uh, Wave... Let's see, what do I got? Wavetable Bells 1, uh, that's what I got so far. But I'm gonna load up the plugin and see if it makes it sound cooler. It's supposed to just distort and manipulate the sounds to make it sound more crazy. gonna go one by one on this. So I'm gonna, these are all turned on right now, so I'm gonna turn them off and then see what each thing does. Uh, so right here, the first one is reverse. Obviously, you can adjust it to do reverse of two bars, one bar, and you can go four, or half, oh, then it's in fraction, so half bar, quarter bar, eighth bar. Pretty cool. Uh, there's there's definitely some other plugins out there that can do stuff like this um, for sure. But to have all six of these on here, and it was free, but it's got legal stipulations with it, so take that as you will. Uh, that's reverse. Here's half speed. I mean, gross speed can do this stuff too. Pitch, pretty self-explanatory. They got a modern and a vintage. Definitely if you're kind of stuck in your beat and you want to switch it up, I mean, that's definitely something you can adjust. Uh, reverb, obviously. Pass and low pass filter. I guess this was on the whole time. So that's cool. I mean, obviously you don't have to EQ it to do this. Just once again, I was staying corrected. It's nine different things in this. Um, 
but obviously if you're trying to do a bridge different than your verse or your chorus and you want to do like a high pass filter that's in there, a level shaper. And then you have the master and the mix here where you can adjust your effect. And then if that wasn't enough, there's presets. Cave plus water. That's definitely if you're trying to create a little vibe. Boom! Right there. Uh, Marty and Doc. I love Back to the Future, so. Outer space. Path dunk. Um, so they also have, so that was the creative preset folder. They got a drums preset folder, a lo-fi, which I think if you are into lo-fi production, you really do need this because it does make your sounds definitely in that genre for sure. Um, let's just check out some lo-fi. Children's Radio. I, this just sounds like the, the next scary horror movie, so I guess if you're also into producing scary sounds, this would just be easy. Vinyl player in a horror movie. I can see it. I'm getting scared right now. Um, what else we got? 80s radio. It's pretty cool. Man. Uh, modulation. They got dirty chorus, mega chorus, singing in the shower.
hi hats real quick. Yeah, so overall, this is a pretty cool plugin. Like I said, um, so overall, this is a pretty cool plugin. Uh, definitely, there's a lot to do, a lot you can do, change the whole aspect of your beat, um, especially if you start recording. And use this to kind of alter your voice. Um, this plugin is really nice. Like I said, it does come with its whole stipulations and, and legalities of it. But I think I will use it and see where it goes and see what happens. So thanks for checking in. If you got B Club, if you got a membership and you haven't and you're waiting on this, I would say go ahead and get it because this is a pretty nice plugin. This has been Mad Honey. Peace.